Hello, hello, everyone, and welcome to Losers Become Winners for February 28, 2020. We have another winner going to the winner's circle. SWK played out today. Let's go look at that chart. 109% in seven days. Let's go prove it. All right, there it is. We got stopped out at SWK. There is the chart. We had set last bar low here, and we got down, it got it opened down here, and then it came up and took us out. All right. All right, so it cost us, it got out at 22.56. What did it cost getting in? Well, the way to do it is come here and put an SWK up here in the dialog box, set the clock back to go find what day we got into the trade, and seven didn't do it. So let's go back to 30 days. And there it is. There's our proof of the pudding. We got in on this trade on the 21st of February and got out today on the 28th. Our, we got out at 22.56. Remember, it's a one contact times 100. It's become 22.56 minus 10.75 that we paid getting into the trade, coming up with 111.81. 1181 divided by the 1075 as a percentage, and the results are 109%. Therefore, we got 109% in seven days. That's it. Uh, now, question, how did they get to the winner's circle? Okay, so we got 2256 minus the 1075 for a trade profit of 1181 minus about two dollars in the new fee structure I, you know it's a dollar 35 i round it up take it away makes it 1179 it we it uh swk owed us 1071 1017 minus 1017 so we made 162 dollars net profit but the point is we won back our loss our loss was 1017. That's what counts. This also now drops down to 59 loss leaders. All right. Okay, that said, let's go on to the rest of the report. And that is we got save here at 331. This is going to be a real dilemma. And the dilemma is. Are we going to go last bar low or the close of the day, which is right here? So if it opens here, we can get out or the last bar low, which is here. We're going to be sticking to our rules until we have a much more point. But the bottom line is save is at 7,154. 7, <laughs> Holy cow. It only owed 887. This is going to be a real sweet exit. So. We're going to be moving the uh, exit down here to the uh, last bar high when the last bar high is going to be around 29.75. So 29.75 will be our stop when I set the exit order. And that would be, a, and this would be changed to a last bar high. So there we go. We got to change our all, change all our stuff. Remember that we got to keep track of our trade journal. Now, I don't like doing paper because it becomes a real pain in the neck I'm trying to find stuff. So I just do it right here. Uh, 75, 29.75. So that's going to happen there. All right. So we got we to gotta put, we have another winner's circle potential. A highly, bases are loaded. Any out will do. So now let's move on to Ma, MasterCard. And MasterCard owes. Now this is another one, another let's let's look at the numbers. I I briefly look at the oh 2450 and they owe us 1018 since 2018. Since 2018, 1018, that is real sweet. We're looking at a real nice potential. Any out will do right there on Ma. And yes, it will be a last bar low right there. And it closed that high. See now what's happening? The market is the, the biggest thing with markets on, is uncertainty. Now, they know about the coronavirus. They know that it's going to impact business. They know it's going to do all these things. Therefore, the market adjusts to how to handle it. And now 
whoever has the least amount of damage will have the fastest recovery. Airlines might have a tough time. All right, that said, we'll be moving there. Now, that takes us down to QQQ. Cool. Uh, QQQ, they owe us, now we look at this. They owe us 2032 from 2014. I mentioned that before. We got down to 596 and QQQ is sitting at 907. So we have another strong potential. Again, you see the green candle is coming up. That means that the market is looking at recovery. Now, how much of a recovery is going to be unknown? That is going to be a real interesting dilemma of what does recovery look like? Does it mean that it comes up here, hovers just below the 30-day moving average line, and then goes on back down and continues down the course? We don't know, but that's, that's going to be a pretty penny. All right, that takes us to ATVI. ATVI is here. Now, we are in last bar low. Why? Bec well, we, uh, because, 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 no, we're not in last bar low. Unfortunately, because it didn't hold, it was up to like something like 40 something percent this morning. But we are going to be winging it down here to defense. We are going to be in the defense. It owes 1081. And if we get, like I said, rocks become pebble, pebble become profit, profit become payback. So we'll be going down into this zone. That takes us down, down to Tau. And look at this. All the positions today are in nice. Nice positive territory. Uh, Tau will be moving here. We gotta, we gotta be moving it down here, and that's gonna be right there. So it's gonna be here. This was a put. It went down. It got into a hammer situation. That's called a hammer. Sometimes it's a positive. But look at the trending. We have a down trending on this MACD. We have a down trending on the on the MACD. We have a down trending on S2C, and we have a down trending on RSI. And the ATR is running at two dollars eighteen cents. Okay, wow! For the that's for the Alpha League. Let's go over to the Tigers. This should be very cool. Going to the Tigers, and the Tigers are holy cow! A hundred and twenty-seven dollars for the Tiger for Coca-Cola. The Tigers come to Papa. Yeah. All right. Yes, I already anticipated we're going to be going here to last bar low. Uh, we got 1538 against 333. Another real potential for another. And finally, the Tigers are going to get a loss leader off the list and get moving along. And a nice, pretty return so that they'll be able to get into position. So the Tigers are going to be closing out at 127 and moving down to last bar low here. Well, guys, wow, that's a long one. I, I, am, I am very sorry that this is such a long, long one, but this was a good day. Here, coming back, rebounding, coming back to the to the stables again. We'll be looking for an out for a save. And that is the end of today's report for losers. I'll get this right one of these days. Losers become winners for 2028-2020. Tune in tomorrow. Let's oh actually tomorrow's a weekend. So let's tune in on Monday and see what happens next. Thank you for stopping by and checking it out. Bye bye.